1,500 kilometers west of the Chengbai Mountains, the Kubuchi Desert stretches out across the Ordos High Plateau like a yellow dragon. With its parched climate and daily extreme changes in temperatures, this harsh environment demands a robustness of all living things that dare to live here. Gansao may seem ordinary, but it grows in extraordinary conditions and plays an indispensable part in the herb world. After dawn, Kalgani drives his flock of sheep out to graze. He is one of the last shepherds left here in the desert plateau. Before retirement, 66-year-old Kalgani was a barefoot doctor. Now every September, harvest permit in hand, he heads out to forage for the most famous herb in the region, Lianwei Gan Cao, or licorice root. The experienced Kalgani can judge the size of the licorice root that's hidden underground from the size of the plant's stalk. The Mongolian licorice hunter's rule of thumb is, dig for big, leave the small. To survive in this inhospitable environment, the licorice needs to grow strong, thick roots and smaller, shorter stalks and leaves. The longest root can reach 3 to 4 meters in length. Gan Cao, named for its sweet taste, improves digestion, filters toxins from the body and clears phlegm from the throat. In traditional Chinese medicine, a saying goes that 90% of formulas contain Gan Cao. In Shang Han Lun by Zhang Zhong Jing, out of 112 formulas, 70 contain Gan Cao. Among all Chinese herbs, Gan Cao is favored in herbal cough formulas. It is found in over half of traditional cough remedies, not only because of its expectorant properties, but also for the role it plays in integrating other various herbs in various mixes of herbs. Gan Cao may seem ordinary, but it grows in extraordinary conditions and plays an indispensable part in the herb world. The idea of sustainable harvesting to a Mongolian Gan Cao hunters like Cal Gani is not a matter of government policy, but one of tradition. The difficult living conditions have forced most of the Mongolian Gansau hunters to move away. Kalgani is one of the remaining few. Gani's way of life with licorice is a simple and holy existence. This herb defines both the boundaries and the frontiers of his life. 